When you attend any car show, you're always gonna have those moments where you spot a car that just catches your eye. And Mike Rick's 1941 Ford convertible fits the bill. It's a, it, it's a unique car, but it's also been, you know, massaged, so it's a little smoother. Mike, great car. Thank you, thank you, Mark. Yeah, we've enjoyed this car for the past 20 plus years. It's had uh, body modifications on it. There's no front bumpers or rear bumpers, roll pan in the back. The headlights are Frenched in as there are the taillights. Um, runs on a Mustang two front end, parallel leafs with a 12 bolt Chevy rear end in the back. It's got a small block Chevy in it that's been bored 30 over with a turbo 350 with a kit. It's got heat and air in it, uh, power windows, power trunk, um, just been a really good car all around. So and I know you've put a lot of miles on this car because I've seen it everywhere. How many miles have you driven this car? Well, we've driven this car, I got to think at least 25, 30,000 miles. And uh, they've been good miles. It's been a very trouble free car and just had no issues with it at all. So it's been just a good car all yeah. around, you know? Yeah, I really love your car and I love the smooth look and everything. But I gotta ask you, Mike, how often does this top come down? The top comes down very often. You get a day like today when it's 90 degrees out, you're better off with the top up so you don't cook when you're driving <laughs> down the street. So that's why the top is up today. Give you a little shade. It's that little secret about convertibles. Everybody thinks a convertible, you put the top down on the hot sunny days, but instead most people put them up just for shade. You put them up for shade. You open the front windows, the rear window unzips, so you get a lot of air flowing through the car and you're fairly comfortable driving down the road. And that top material, that's great. Is that like, that's like a cloth material? It's a cloth it? top, yes. And um, you gotta be careful with a cloth top. You wanna, when, you, when you're done with the top down, you put it up so the top doesn't get wrinkles in it. It stays okay. stretched out. So you wanna keep the top up as much as you can. That's correct. The, uh, another thing, the interior, you know, you got beautiful interior and in is that all like blue? It's all a cloth interior in oh, it. Very nice. And I like the cloth personally better than leather because it's cooler it is, on a day it like is. today. And, and in uh, a convertible, having a little cooler interior isn't such a bad thing. It's not a bad thing for, you know, you get a day like today again, when it's 90 degrees, you get in a leather interior and you just stick to the seats by the time you're home. So I like the cloth interior the best. And this kind of milkshakey, kind of creamy color. What color? Do you know what the color is? This is a 19, uh, let's see, 1990, I believe, Honda color okay and it's called almond cream very and nice it just it, looks clean and fresh and i like cream colored cars i have a <laughs> another car at home that's cream colored they don't show the dust so <laughs> <laughs> your car can be a little dusty in there they still look good well i know you used to have a really nice dark colored 34 ford i had at one time i had five black cars <laughs> and trust me I love black as a color, but they're a pain in the butt. To <laughs> they're keep ne up. They never look clean. They never look clean. And, so. and of course, all the side, all the insignias are off the car. Although you still got your body side trim. Side trim is on it. Uh, it's been nosed and decked. No, yep. We got a power trunk, so that opens up electrically. Uh, the doors are uh, Rodtronic, keyless entry type doors. Okay. And. Um, so yeah, your door handles, I didn't even catch that right away. Your door handles are gone too. Those are all shaved. The rear fenders are molded in and the running boards are molded in and everything's body color. So it's very easy to keep clean. So what's the furthest trip you've taken in this? The furthest trip uh, that I've personally done in it is down to Lincoln, Nebraska and uh, drove down there, the car was flawless all the way down and all the way back uh, with zero problems. So drives nice on the freeway. Drives it? real nice with the uh, uh, independent front rear uh, suspension. It drives just super on the highway. Great. No problems. This is just a beautiful car. I love looking at this thing. It's the kind of car you can look at all day long. Mike, the thing I like about this car is just smooth. All the lines are smoothed out and this roll pan underneath and your license plates Frenched in and 
and then the, the Lincoln taillights just Frenched in, just gives it that really smooth look. It does, it gives it a very smooth look. And I'll tell you something else, with no bumpers, it's very easy to clean the back and the front <laughs> with no bumpers. Do you ever have to worry about bumping into anything? No, I'm a good driver. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not. <laughs> And of course, no door handle. So how do you get into yours, Mike? Well, I push this button like this, Mark. And, and you're it, in. And the door pops open, see? <laughs> Just like that. Real simple. Very neat. That looked good. All right, Mike. We've taken a look at the whole outside, the beautiful interior. Let's take a look under the hood. Okay, I'll open her up for you. Wow, that's nice and clean in there, Mike. Well, Mark, over the winter time, since there was nothing to do because we were all <laughs> shut in, I polished all of the aluminum and cleaned everything up really, really good. And um, so it gave me something to do over the winter time. Well, that looks nice, Mike. Well, I'm glad you like it, Mark. And, uh, you know, like I say, it's great seeing this car, neater to see what's under the hood. Love seeing this thing out at the shows. Thanks for sharing it with us. Well, you're more than welcome. Great. Right, I'll talk to you later, and uh, we'll see each other in another Rod Runs shortly. Awesome. Yeah.